Green bean casserole. This is the one that you've been looking for. This is the traditional one, the one that's been around forever. I know that sometimes maybe you think, well, I want to change it up. I want to make a fancier one. But the thing is this, you're really looking for the memory of that, I think, when it comes to the holidays, Thanksgiving, that sort of thing. So it's what you've always had, it's what your grandmother used to have, and uh, it makes it fun. So this is what you need, three to four cans of green beans. You also need a can of cream of mushroom, a teaspoon of soy sauce, and those fried onions that you buy out off the counter. So this is about a cup and a half, and then you want to reserve about a half cup because you'll put these on at the very end. So let's go ahead and get started to the third one up here. This always reminds me of Thanksgiving holidays and things like that. And I have tried to make a sort of, I guess you might call it an upscale or a uh, all homemade kind of version of it where you make it from scratch. And it's really, it's not the taste that you're looking for. It's really not, a lot of times they're good, uh, but it's just not what you're thinking in your mind, right? So, okay, there we go. Put my garbage bowl over here. Can of cream of mushroom soup. The nice thing about this dish is when you're working on Thanksgiving and you're trying to get stuff together, this is an easy one uh, that everybody likes. And I would say everybody likes it once a year. I don't know too many people that make it all the time. When I was a kid my mom would have casserole night. And she would make three casseroles in one night. She'd make a green bean casserole, a squash casserole, and a chicken casserole. I was a pretty young kid. It wasn't really my fa favorite night, uh, but that's what it was. This is a teaspoon of soy sauce. All right, so let's stir this around a little bit. Kind of get this going. I will tell you that I had a little trouble finding. I was looking for cut green beans. These are whole green beans because I think the traditional recipe calls for cut green beans. Couldn't find them. So in the grocery store that I was in, I'm sure if I had looked around and looked around, I probably would have found them. There we go. That's how fast this dish comes together. You want to put it in a quart and a half to two quart uh, casserole dish oven 350 degrees you're only going to cook this about 25 minutes and then you'll pull it out and put in the remaining fried onions that we have here so let's just kind of get it in our dish it smells the same it's always the same uh, which is comfort in that and it brings back all of those memories okay so oven 350 degrees about 25 minutes, we'll bring it out, we'll put the remaining onions on there, and then we'll let it cook another five minutes, and it will be ready for the Thanksgiving Day table. All right, here it is, our green bean casserole. It just smells like Thanksgiving. You can smell the green beans, you can smell those onions in there. We've got to try it. Take a little bite here. Oh my gosh, it's hot. All right, so here we go. Mm. It's just right. This is Thanksgiving. It's right up there beside the turkey. I hope you enjoy it.